Is that game? is UTX Untamed Rush bringing you some more Battlefield on Operation Firestorm and this is Rush and I'm glad you guys want more you guys you know are hitting me on my channel hitting me on every video I post I always get that one comment post more Battlefield and I'm glad for that I'm really happy um, for the most part because I'm glad people are going from a different direction to Call of Duty you know it's, it's basically with the decline in popularity of Call of Duty, let's be honest, you know, it's not getting, it's really just losing its popularity amongst diehard fans. So, people are turning to other games, and that, you know, that's allowing people to just try other games. So, people are trying Battlefield, they're enjoying it. Um, I see a lot more people switch to PC, or, you know, they get it for console, and I think that's great. Um, I'm glad to see that, and I'm glad that you guys want to see more, more of it. And for the most part, you're gonna see here in this video. The, the main topic of this video is the flank, um, because I, as you can see, I'm not in the squad. I'm by myself, um, so I gotta play to the best of my abilities. And running the flank worked out for me right here on this AM com. Yeah, I get these two guys, and then this, like this guy. I end up missing him, um, but I get him later. I come around. And when I do find a squad, my squad is all running recon. They're all sniping up on the mountain. I know everybody's familiar. You can see all those blue dots down there. That's that's them. So um, I joined in on them and they're completely useless to me. So I had to run this on my own and flanking was for the most part what I needed to do. And I get killed by the tank. So I'm running the MG36 and this is the last gun out of the LMGs. There's only two, but this is the second one that you gotta unlock through assignments and the assignments are um, 100 kills with a light machine gun 50 suppression assists and the last one is 50 ammo resupplies now the first and last one are real easy to get but the second one it could take a little long and one way to cut down on that time is to use the squad suppression if you don't have squad suppression yet use regular suppression it's your best bet it'll help you do it a lot quicker you know when you miss targets and I love the C4s but when you miss targets um, you don't even have to really get that close to them all you gotta do is be firing in their direction and you'll get some suppression on them and if your teammates come through and kill them then you'll get them a lot easier so it does help out um, I would I would use that uh, I would use that or have somebody in your squad use uh, squad suppression and it'll help out um, right here I got real cocky because I felt like I was, you know, they didn't know where I was and I thought I was good and I ended up trying to run up on this tank but they spotted me. I guess he had proximity scan, I'm not sure. But they ended up killing me. That would have made for a nice clip but they hopped out the tank and got me. And um, right here I just, you know, play support and hold down the, B, the, the BM comp. And that's basically it. And if you look in the screen right now, my squad, you see all of them have the little recon logo emblem. It's like... And they're all on that mountain behind me. All on the mountain. They're, none of them are over here by the bomb trying to plant it. They can't even see the bomb from where they're at. So they're useless. Um, and I hate that. It's like, oh, you see, you see somebody's running recon. Why are everybody running recon? It doesn't make sense. So I was on my own this whole game. And um, I fast forward through the parts that I did skip some, some parts there that I could have shown. But I just felt like cutting down the time and just basically concentrate on the flanking like you see right here i'm running wide right I'm all the way out in the right i see the sniper over here because i heard him shooting so i was trying to find him i wasn't sure if he was on this rocks but then i realized he was going to be down on those and i just spotted him and kept it moving there's no sense in me getting into a fight you know you got to pick your fights especially in a game like this and sniper he had more cover you know he had the the, the height advantage over me and you know so he basically had you know, he had a, oh my God, I, I can't even think of the word, but he had the advantage in that gunfight. I hate that. I, I hate when I think of a word and it's on the tip of my tongue and right when I need to say it, I forget it. It happens to me on a constant basis. But um, anyway, so these guys, uh, this was kind of like a stupid trade-off because I, they ended up getting the position back anyway, you know? And I was getting hit from the sniper across the way, and then this guy killed me. So it was just a bad, that was a bad play on my part. 
uh, really didn't help the team but then again my team ain't helping me so <laughs> it doesn't matter you just a couple of selfish moves don't hurt so again I'm running the flank again this time I'm coming around the left and for the most part I know where they're at I know there's a guy up top but I go to check to see if somebody's coming behind me and I come and get him and he's not expecting me he's you know he got, I got him on, on a surprise and I get the easy plan that's what it's about. Everybody's over by B. All the actions by B. So I just run the flank. It's the best bet. And you're putting pressure on the team because now they don't know which bomb to go to. I had to take a sip of my coffee. But a couple of them start coming to B, but then they go to I mean start coming to A, but then they go to B because the B was where everybody's at. So they get control of B again. I think they disarm it. But I get A. And it works out. So, like, that's another thing, like, you gotta remember that this is a sandbox, this is a sandbox shooter, first person shooter, so, you, you're you not restricted to a map layout, like, say, Call of Duty, um, you could run as far to the left as you can until you go out of bounds, and you'll know when you go out of bounds, because it'll, you'll see it on the screen, it has like a, it looks like a, how do you say it? It's like a shaded line and a non-shaded line. It just you can tell it's out of bounds. And plus your screen turns gray and it tells you to turn back. So but for the most part, those boundaries are so far out that it just gives you the freedom to roam. And you see right here again, I'm running on the flank. They don't know I'm coming. See, I don't stay running straight. I just keep going out as far as I can, stay within the cover, and just go. And I get the easy plan on A all three times. All three bomb sites, I get the plan on A real easy because everybody's concentrating on the B. Because they feel like A's, A's usually the easy one to defend on this map, you know? But for the most part, they couldn't do it. They, they weren't paying attention to it. I was able to get in there. So it was just real easy and quick. And right here, I actually just fast forwarded because I got this MCOM. It was just hands down uh, real easy. And for the most part, that's basically the end of the game. You're just going to see me like try to support a little bit and I get a couple of kills and uh, keep the guys off the flank but um yeah for the most part I um I keep battlefield coming um thank you I appreciate I noticed when I put a battlefield I get like like three or three or four subs every time it's crazy and um that's motivation right there to just keep posting it um but even though the fact that you guys want to see it and you guys get stuff from my videos is great and you see right here these guys I, I, I wasn't letting them set up there was no way they were gonna set up, and this is the full. This is a full uh, server. It looks like it's not, but it is. It's just everybody's concentrating on the BM comp all the way through, and they never changed up their game at, not once. Uh, I had to drop on them. So, yeah, man, I'll keep the battlefield coming. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it, and for the most part, I'll probably post some more today. Well, no, I got my my. I want to do my free for all Friday. Uh, it's a uh, gameplay that I have there. I want to put that up. It's Friday. Why not? And uh, if you guys don't get to check any of my other videos, man, have a good holiday, a Merry Christmas. And uh, I'll probably talk about that on my Free Fall Friday video. And that's the final score. Until next time, I'm out. Peace.